Hello everyone, it is Yellowfin and we are back at the Sarasota Cars and Coffee and you guys are in for a real treat this time because whole entire lot's been filled. They're turning people away. So many people have come here. And so we're just gonna start on the one side, work our way down to the other side and just, yeah, this is gonna be a long video. I might split it, actually I am gonna split it into two parts. We'll have the polls in another video coming on the next day. So if you're watching this one right now, subscribe so you can see all the polls leaving. We'll start it off with a Maserati 3000, I believe. I don't know, I'll edit it in if it's not, or we can check right around here on the back. Nope, it doesn't say. But I believe it's a Maserati 3000. Actually, never seen something like this. I like these older, I believe it's 90s, Maseratis. This is actually really clean spec. I do like the amber lights on the front as well. That's really cool. We got the racing stripe on it. Big Maserati logo up top too. That's pretty clean. Then we got a slammed Civic over here. Another one with camber on it too. Pretty tough. Beamer wagon over here. We got the Supras, of course. Lowered Finities. And then what else? We got Stang and the Camaro. The duo lineup right here with the hoods popped. And then we got a C6 Vet as well. Mazda CX-5 right here. But I don't think that one was intended to be at the show. Suzuki Cappuccino. Ford Mustang, pretty nice. Ooh, Audi RS6 Avant. That's pretty clean right here, look at that. Very nice, Honda Civic. Dodge Charger with a wing on it, aftermarket wing. Got a Lexus, I don't know, IS350 I believe, F-Sport. That'd be my guess. Got more Stangs over here, lots of Stangs. We'll be seeing a bunch of those. And then the Vet lineup, of course gotta have multiple of those i bet that's not the first one we'll be seeing there's four c7s right there green camaro that green color actually is really nice got something missing the bumper and a big old chevy pickup truck pontiac gto very clean one as well the judge edition that's that's very sweet actually very nice porsche taken some mercedes two of them actually lined up slks Got some Beamers, Oldsmobile, that's, okay, let's actually check that out. I do like older, like 80s, 70s American cars. This thing's actually really sweet. Old, Oldsmobile Cutlass. That's actually super clean. That's honestly might be one of my favorites I've seen here. I just really like these older American cars. Honestly, might might get one in the future. They're just super clean looking especially out in them like nice and stock like that we got corvette with the pop-up delete that's an interesting choice more mercs alfa romeo spider that's a cool one next to an el camino then we got a shelby cobra over here next to an aston martin vanquish nice aston martin vanquish it seems like since i said it in the car spotting video of not seeing very many astons here in just sarasota in general there's been a very large influx in Aston Martins. That's also a very nice Shelby Cobra too. Next to the truck. Oh, and I missed a little key truck over there as well. BMW M5 CS. That's really cool as well with that BMW matte green sort of color. Hit a little zoom in on that because that's a real nice car. BMW supercar kind of because you wouldn't really consider the i8 a supercar. El Camino as well. Then we got two Subies. 90s and new. Well, I guess not new anymore. FC RX7 though. Look at that. That's a very nice ride right there. Lowered with the three-piece wheels next to another FCRX7. It's very nice though, the difference. Cause that one's not, not like completely stock, but it's got aftermarket rims on it, but then you got the fully tuned one as well. Those are pretty tough. And then that is only the first row. Like we've got like eight more to go. Oh, and I see something that's caught my eye. Uh, I see you guys have probably seen it too, but let's look over here real quick. Chevy truck, Dodge Charger Rally. Then we got a Honda Del Sol. But then look at this right here. Ford GT. Have not seen one of those in a very long time. Dang. Look at that. We'll work our way around eventually, but let's just keep on scrolling on over through the rest of the stuff first. Because I don't need to be in the way as Mr. YouTube guy plowing through people to get a view of the Ford GT. We can just work our way around because that's what we're doing. More BMWs, Camaros, Mustangs. Oh, there's a new Mustang. First new Mustang I've actually seen. That's cool to see one. And an FD RX-7. That's very nice as well. Jacked up Tahoe, Ford Lightning. 
But look at that, there's one of those new Mustangs. I actually should get a look at that. What's the interior looking like on these? Compare it to the previous newer Mustangs. Well, I guess that guy's got tint, so that guy's also got a bit of tint. We can't really see too much, but actually pretty clean. I do like it, Mustang GT next to a Mach 1 as well. That's some big old side skirts on that thing too. Got Cadillac, Charger 392, GMC with the Longhorn on it. Oh, and a 70 year edition, I believe that's what it is, Chevy Corvette C8. That's pretty cool. Now what's that running? Oh, that's what's running. It's a Lamborghini Huracan entering the meet. Also, there's a Ferrari 458 over there now, too. I believe it's a 458, not a 488. Supra over there, too. Porsche. Porsche. Very nice. We'll have to check out some of the supercars later as well. We could go back over there and give it a look if anything else pulls up. Oh, wait. Look at that. Lamborghini Murcielago over there. It's in the bushes now, but there it is. That's super sweet. We also got a... A very modified Scion with a Tesla logo on it, so maybe it's an electric swap. It doesn't sound like it's an electric swap, though. I can hear an engine rumbling. And there we got a nice little McLaren, too. A little McLaren 570S action. We got a jacked up, not lowered at all, Toyota Tacoma over there. Got a nice little Mercedes, Porsche 911. That's a very clean one. Nissan GTR, matte black. Very nice. A Infiniti FX35. Another Aston Martin. This one, I believe, is a... I think it's one of the DB series. I'm not sure which one, though, but an Aston Martin DB something. Then here, look at this, on the airbags. Slammed vet. Very, very nice. That is very low, too. Like, honestly, pretty close to low as about nearly touching the ground. There's a little bit of gap, but honestly, it's about as low without hurting those splitters and side skirts. And we got another nice Porsche right there. That's actually a pretty clean one with that gray. Another Beamer, Audi, Honda Ridgeline Black Edition, Mazda Miata. Then we got two Broncos over here. These are very nice to see. Two-door and a four-door with the roof off on the one. Oh, and look at this. Lotus Turbo Esprit. That's sick. And we'll also get a look. I didn't even notice that before because I was distracted by the 4GT. So we got... The GT right there. And then a Lotus Turbo Esprit. This is a very nice ride though, the Lotus Turbo Esprit. That's pretty cool. We might have to go back to the Ford GT to get that thumbnail shot. I don't know though, we gotta check the other side first. It is in close contention for the thumbnail car though. Nice little slammed Honda Civic Si over here and then a Datsun. That's a pretty sweet ride. But now that is just the first half. And that's more of the smaller half. Normally, that's never even filled up that much. And we've still got a whole nother half to go. So, we're, we're just getting started. And we've already seen Ford GT, Nissan GTR, Lotus Turbo Esprit, um, Slammed Vets, Lamborghini Murcielago, which we should probably go back and check, and a Lamborghini Huracan, and a Ferrari as well, if you want to include that too. Supra's old Mark III Supra. That's cool with the sleepy headlights. Amber lights on the Porsche 911, that's sick. More Stingers ZL11LE. A new, oh, that's actually a pretty nice looking GR86. Look at that, all aftermarket all around. We can zoom out a bit more. Big old wing on the back too. That's actually pretty sweet. You got nice little older 911 here. Saab with a missing front bumper boosted according to the plate too that's pretty nice quick little sob don't see those too often maybe we'll start seeing sobs now now that i said that got one of those ferrari wagons i forgot what those were called but yeah i think it's 599 i'm probably wrong and another aston martin next to an acura nsx so three aston martins now i said it once you haven't seen too many astons and now three of them are here at the cars and coffee thing is like how many Astons have I seen like I've seen so many Astons now today it's actually actually kind of cool so make a prediction I bet we're gonna see two more two more Astons so let's see multiple vets here's our second vet lineup this one's got some older vets too c4 vet that's nice to see catfish Camaro c3 vet as well 
you've seen quite a few of those in the previous video at the um, Lakewood Ranch car meet. A lot of C3 vets there. That was in the thumbnail before. Kia Soul, Hyundai Genesis. I am starting to get get to like those Hyundai Genesis coupes quite a bit. Scion, BMW M2, newer one. Nice little Mazda Miata over here. Got 911 over here. Old Stang Vert. Got a Dodge Challenger with the condom on. Uh, Mazda, oh, here we go, Mazda 6. Let's see what they're rocking. Cyraka Mazda, let's see what they got. Looking pretty solid, I like it, I like it. I do like a good Mazda. It's this big open area for, we're gonna do burnouts or something? Got a Corvette right here. And then we also missed it, we'll go back around. Everyone's favorite car, the Mark IV Supra. Oh my gosh. Yep, the little kids are happy now. Then we got Audi TT over there in that C8 Corvette. Oh, there's a GMC Cyclone. Wait, wait, zoom. Oh, GMC Cyclone. First one of those I've seen. Also another Lamborghini Huracan pulling up right now. I want to know what that area is blocked off for though. It's got orange on it too, orange accents on the Huracan. That's pretty sweet. Got a Jaguar XJS over here. I know what that is. Oh, is that a Citroen? It is a Citroen. Citroen CX, I believe. Yeah, Citroen CX. That's that's a nice one. 1987. That's pretty sweet. It's a turbo too. I got a Ferrari F430. I think I got that right. I might have actually got a Ferrari right for once. Hey, there's that Audi. They're back. They used to be here a lot. Oh. Here we go, there's Aston Martin number four now. This one's a DB11. I do know that one. More Jags, that's a really nice black Jag as well. Got a, I feel like I know what this is. It's a Panos AIV, I believe, Roadster. I actually did not know what that was. Audi R8 V10 Spider. that's pretty tough. Next to the Aston Martin. And then here's the third vet lineup. And a smaller, oh no, actually there's four. And tried to be five, but a Camaro went in the way. Five vets. Then a Mustang official pace car right here. It's pretty sweet. That's a very nice Porsche 911 right there too. That one's pretty clean. Fiat Abarth. Um, we got a sailboat, I guess. That's cool looking sailboat though. BMW. What else? Let's work our way down this aisle now. Oh, here we go. Another Lamborghini Aventador, or not Aventador, Huracan, I mean, in a 05 Ford GT. So now we got both Ford GTs here. 05 or the 06 one, it's not, eh, one of the two. 06 Ford GT, and then the newer Ford GT. That's pretty cool. Got another vet, not in a lineup though, and a Ferrari SF90. I believe, or maybe I got it wrong. No, it's, it's an F8. I'm, I don't know. I am not good with Ferrari still. That's the one brand I'm not good at. I'm good with Jags now because I went to the Jaguar meet. Probably should have gone to the Ferrari meet and learned, but I didn't. I was busy that day. So, oh well. That's what the power of editing's for. I'm gonna edit in that little thing. You'll know what Ferrari it is. I just won't know what Ferrari it is until I edit the video. Buick Grand National GNX. That's sweet. Another Mark IV Supra. We got over here, this is another very nice one. Dodge Viper. Never see very many of those either. So that's very cool. Lots of, actually, variety here. Like we got all the tuner cars, we got the trucks, we got the random key cars, we got the old muscle cars, we got the old school American cars, just the old school cars in general. And then we got like all the works of the different, like just like sports cars. Got a little Nissan hatchback over here. USDM though, not JDM, that's cool. Porsche, Porsche 914. Oh, and here's a little new car, Cadillac Electric, I believe. What does it look like? It's got an engine in the front though. Pretty sure this thing's electric, looks electric. Let's see, what is it? Yeah, it is the Cadillac Lyric. That is an electric car. Then, very big Wang Gang, Mazda Miata Mark I over here. All right. We're kind of stuck. Oh, but here goes that Lambo though. Little zoom in, boom. Got him. 
All right, now working our way back down this aisle. Plymouth. Um, oh, these are actually some nice little old trucks right here too. Little key truck right there. Beamer M3, M2 lineup. Two Volkswagen Bugs, and there's actually a third one over on the other side too. We saw that one already. Toyota Land Cruiser, that's a cool one to see. Haven't seen one of those. Firebird, C3 vet, C7 vet. Didn't get much of a vet lineup to go in there. Two Toyota 86s, then a Scion FRS. Polaris Slingshot. I haven't seen one of those actually pull up to a, like a Cars and Coffee or a car meet before. I've seen these guys on Instagram with the Toyota van. Um, very chrome. Chevy Nomad. Pontiac GTO. We need to see one more Aston Martin and the prediction will hit. I don't know. It's going to be close. Pontiac. No Astons. No Astons. Mustang though. That's cool. Truck, a bit of rumble to it. A little bit of chop to that truck. And there's a something. Oh yeah, it's another one of those old Mercedes. See up CT4V, that thing probably rips too. Nissan GTR in black. And then Bentley Continental Vertible. That's pretty clean. It's 2K with the yellow wheels. That's actually nice. Not seen something like that. Bimmers, Vets, Civics. A, another Porsche. This is a different Porsche though. Instead of one of those Speedsters, it's more one of the coupe ones. It's pretty cool. Next to an Austin Healey. That truck is probably very fast. Got the big old intercooler right on the front. Vet, Vet. Another pace car. There's two of them now. Chrysler 300. Don't see very many of those at these meets. Another WRX, lot of WRX actually, a lot of Subaru representation at this meet. Do not see very many of those before, but there is quite a few this time. Triumph TR6, we do seem to see a lot of those. I don't ever really see them out driving though. Lower riders, there we go, that's nice. Do like to see some low riders, a lot of Lincolns too. This is like my type of section right here. Old. 80s American cars. You gotta love it. A lot of them, too. Don't wanna. Nice little 3000 GT right there as well. But don't wanna get in the way of all the other kids recording. We gotta let them get their good shots. Nice little Viper right there as well. SRT? Yep, SRT Viper. Sweet. Now we'll make our way back over to the one line where I know the Omni Energy Lamborghini Aventador should be. Actually, we did miss one more row too, the one with the weird little sign because we cut through it. Very loud Chevy Monte Carlo, I believe that's what it is. A nice little Nissan Z right here. Toyota Supra, Pontiac Solstice. Something missing a bumper, I'd assume a 180SX. It is. It's, it's missing a lot of stuff. Another 180SX, Shelby Cobra. Audi with some pops and bangs. Shelby Stangs. More Stangs. And then a Back to the Future Tesla Model X. All right, now we'll work our way back over to the other line. All right, we'll see how good we can record this. A lot of people, though. It's a cluster over here. We got Porsche through the cracks. You can see it right there. RS6 with the roof box on top. Nissan GTR. Infinity. A lot of camera people. We'll, we'll work our way around. We'll slide through the cracks. There's a Hummer, though. One of the new ones, electric. Very carbon fiber covered GTR. Got nice little Mercedes, Ferrari. We'll weave our way back around. There's that Lamborghini Aventador. That one right there, nice. Nice little Hummer right there. Oh, Beamer and GTR Nismo, that's cool. I don't know if we saw GTR Nismo last time, we may have. But that's very nice. Golf R32. Mini Cooper. Um, got Audi's Audi R8. Boat management. That's a nice Audi R8 though. Challenger, I believe, just turned on. And oh, here's something else interesting. A Alfa Romeo 4C. The Sarasota Cars and Coffee Alfa Romeo 4C. 
That's pretty cool. And yep, now we'll work our way back over and see if we can see that Mercial Lago, and then that might be it for this vid. Here's a little Porsche 944 action. That's nice. 911 right behind it too. Oh, that sounds good. That's very nice. And then also something I forgot to say about this Miata over here. I said it was part of Big Wang Gang, but it's got something more than Big Wang Gang. It's got a Chevy LS swap in it. So another one of the people that were able to shove a Chevy LS into the little engine bay of a Mark 1 Miata. And there it is the fifth Aston Martin to hit the projection. I was walking back to get the thumbnail shot of the 4GT and oh, that is very zoomed in. Here's the fifth one. So prediction did hit. We got to see five Aston Martins here. Very nice. And there is that Mercialago Lambo right over here. That's very nice, blacked out headlights. That's a pretty sweet ride. Dang, that's very cool. Haven't seen a clean Mercialago also in a very long time. So that's a nice one to see. Nice little Mustang right there too. Oh, well, that was the one we talked about before next to the Camaro, the Duo. So yeah, that will probably be it for this video. We've got another video of the polls coming though. So stay tuned for that. Uh, like, subscribe. And yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.